Hey folks, I'm Bill Langer and you're watching Traditional Adventures TV. In this episode we're going to unbox my new Black Widow Longbow. I want to thank you for coming along. a nice bow side. So we quiver, top and bottom. This is new. You need how this handle goes together here. Uh, the slip fits, string keeps it together. Pretty cool. This is a PLX 64 inches, it's 50 pounds at 28 inches of draw. It's made out of Bacot or Bacote, depending on how you want to pronounce it. Black Widow sticker. Got string silencers here. I'm going to use them just for this setup, but I'll probably end up putting on uh, some sort of wool or something is what I prefer to use. So I decided to use a Selway slip-on bow quiver, um, five arrow quiver. I like them. I think they're quiet. They work work well. I've used them on uh, my other longbows and recurves. Um, it's an all around good quiver. Slips right on there. It's quiet, stays tight. swivel so you can adjust it to get the right angle for your arrows. So before I put the string on, I'm going to put the silencers on. And about a foot down from the end is where I like my string silencers to be. Just separate the black from the red with this particular string and it just slips right in. These little holes right here that the string sits in. Just gonna put one on each side for right now. Get ready at about a foot. To the other end, same deal. Stretch it out. Untwist it. Separating the black strands from the red strands. Take these spider silencers and slip them in. And there's holes, holes in the silencer, so I'll just double check it here that it's at about a foot. Just slide it up. Okay. Now I'll put the string on the longbow. Longbow here. Slide the string on the top limb. Not far enough where I can get this. 
making the string grooves. Real nice having a brand new wax lip string. That's set. That's set. Try to always use a stringer. It's uh, safer for the bow and yourself. Black Widow provides them with every bow purchase. String lined up. Tight. Looks a little high to me, but that's okay. Let's shoot the string in. I usually like them at about six and a half. This right here is at about seven. Seven and a quarter. So I'll untwist, take it back off and just untwist it a little bit. So we can get closer to that. I usually start off shooting at about seven inches, and by the time you shoot the string in, you'll have it down to about six and a half. I like to shoot these black widow longbows. Everybody has different different preferences on them. Just gonna twist it a little bit. Go. Starting to spit rain here a little bit. Maybe getting wet. But I've untwisted the string a little bit. Hopefully this is gonna be at about seven, roughly. Seven inches of brace height. So yeah, there we go. I'm gonna start off shooting at about seven inches of brace height. I like to shoot them right around six and a half. Everything's seated nice. Put the wind tip protector on. Okay. Now I'm gonna set the knock height. They send you with like four or five knock sets. So, put this on. Now again, I had this same bow in a 60 pound bow. I'm just preparing for as the years go on here. This is a 50 pound bow. But I usually shoot, set the knock set at about a half inch above the shelf height. Get rain down here. Got it set at about a half inch above the riser height here. Um, works on the other bow, we'll try it on this one and we'll adjust as we go. Well, the string silencers are on, knock sets in place. Um, got the brace height set at about seven and it will stretch and go down. I like to shoot it at about six and a half inches. Um, we'll go ahead and start sending some arrows down range and see how she performs and we'll see what she likes to eat. Got these uh, carbon shafts, 400s, traditional only from Three Rivers with the 250 grain woodsman up front. It's what I shoot out of all my other hunting bows of varying weights. Uh, we'll give a rip with a few of them and see how they fly. Take 
Well, I'm hitting pretty good with her. Uh, she needs a little bit more tuning. Arrows aren't flying perfect, but they are hitting right in the kill zone, which is that's all I'm looking for. Uh, new Blackwood longbow, 64 inch, 50 pounds at 28 inches of draw. Can't wait to take her out hunting. <laughs>